Good ball, picks out Porter, in space, three options in front, chips it forward to Naylor. Tony Naylor, Ray Walker, too much pace on it, Walker with the shot, and it's in the net, Ray Walker! Well, he's made up for the earlier miss, Ray Walker, but Port Vale, they did that the hard way. They made about seven passes before Ray Walker took the return off Tony Naylor. I thought that ball had run a bit too far for Ray Walker. He took it an extra yard, firing the shot. It came off the post. But who cares? Plays it back to Porter. Short ball from Porter to Bogey to Tankard to Foyle. Foyle surely pushes a penalty. Port Vale have a penalty. Martin Foyle clearly bundled off the ball. 28 minutes gone. Now the question is, who's going to take it? Andy Porter steps up. And I'm not sure if there's been a booking over there because my eyesight uh, wasn't that good, but the referee has pointed to the penalty spot. Now who's going to take it? Andy Porter. Port Vale 1, Crystal Palace 0. Could this be 2? It's Andy Porter v Nigel Martin. FA Cup third round. 2-0. Andy Porter takes the salute of the Bikers. I think they certainly will, yes. I mean, <coughs> Crystal Palace have got to pick the game up now. The, uh, this, they certainly didn't notice when they picked the game up when... Uh, when they went one down, but well, is that it? It is, it's gone in. Well, I tell my words back. They have picked the game up and they're back in the game. Well, number 10, Gareth Taylor came in off the inside stanchion there. Paul Vale just stood and watched. And well, Guppy and Tanks, the one two not coming off. But look at that ball from Stuart Talbot. Excellent ball. Steve Guppy now. Can he get the crossover? Turns his man. And Martin Fowl! What a goal! What a goal! Steve Guppy, the instigator. Martin Foyle, the clinical finisher. Port Vale 3. St Crystal Palace 1. And Steve Guppy, every right to look happy there. They're pushing everyone forward. Over it comes. And it's in there. Well. I think. I think it was a substitute. Ian Cox. First team television, as always. Bringing you the pictures. But Palace with the corner. Muscle White with the catch. Off the line by Guppy, a 10, and they've equalised. And is it Dean Gordon? Or is it the substitute? As soon as the fog clears from over there. I can tell you who it is. I think it could be one of the substitutes. Into the Veil goal. Paul Musselwhite reading the ball very well. Sends a long ball centre field. Good control by McCarthy. Turns well. Takes the one two. Ray Walker. Still Walker. Turns it in. A what a goal from Ray Walker. What an absolute corker. Just when you thought he'd lost it. The substitute. Just turns calm as you like. Curls it into the top corner past the outstretched hand of Nigel Martin. And it's Paul Vale 4, Crystal Palace 3.